Hey guys, so to start off with this tutorial, what we're going to do is we're going to launch PyCharm and we're going to create a new project. And we're going to call this project Data Frame Search. Okay, we're going to create and then we're going to right click on the folder and create a new Python file. And we're going to call this Python file Data Frame Search. Okay, and then what we're going to do is we're going to import the libraries that we need. So we're going to import Tkinter as Tk. We're going to say from path lab, path lib, import path. And then from Tkinta, import TTK. And then from Tkinta DND2, import DND files and Tkinta DND. And I've explained this in a previous video, but um, Tikinta DND is basically a wrapper around Tikinta. And in order to follow this tutorial, you'll need to um, have this downloaded on your computer. So in order to do that, um, just check my previous video if you haven't done so already on how to do this. Um, and then we're also going to import pandas as PD. And if you don't have pandas, um, you can simply pip install that on your command prompt. Okay. So first things first, we're just going to create our application class. So we're going to get a class application, and we're going to inherit from Tkinta DND .tk. So basically, Tkinta DND is a wrapper around Tkinta, and it has its own initialization for the GUI, and that's what we're going to inherit from, so we can have the access to the um, drag and drop functionality on our widgets. Okay, so we're going to inherit from it. Let's go underscore initialize self and then super and that's basically the constructor for our um parent widget which in this case is to kinta dnd dot tk okay so now we're going to create self dot title because we can inherit from the um attributes from to kinta um to dnd so our title is going to be equal to, let's just call it CSV viewer. Self dot main frame. So this could be the main, uh, main underscore frame. All our widgets are going to be bound to in this like project. Okay. So, so let's take into frame and self dot main frame dot pack for the fill with the X and Y axis, and we're going to expand the widgets to the size of the parents. So expand equals true. Then self.geometry is going to equal to 900 width by 500 height. Okay, and that's all for now. So what we're going to do is we're just going to run it and check. So if underscore name equals, sorry, underscore, equals under underscore main underscore underscore we're going to initialize our root so application again we can call this because we're inheriting from the um tkinta initializer so we can um simply just uh initial create this object and we'll have access to the main loop which will then run an infinity loop which will um enable us to open the GUI window so if we do that and then run data frame search, here's our GUI created. So in the next tutorial, I'll create the other objects and explain those as well in more detail. Okay, so see you in the next one.